Hey, Mercy and company, I wanted to congratulate you with the reviews that you have on this listing. I know how competitive the category can be. So to see the ratings you have and the review score you have is incredible. Job well done. Now, my job is to look for potential opportunities with sellers who prioritize on Amazon. And if it's okay with you, I'd like to show you a large module which you have for this listing, but you're not using it. It takes a valuable real estate. So um, that in addition to a few other things I noticed. My name is Sean and I'm an account executive with my Amazon guy. So listen, I'm gonna pack this full of valuable information. It's designed to help grow sales. I'll show you the module in just a minute, but the first thing I wanna review are keywords. Now we utilize this tool to look at sponsored and organic keywords. We do a ton of competitive research and other things. And I'm noticing you've got 346 sponsored, 451 organic keywords. Now I'm curious, these are low, these are low. Uh, we tend to see organics in the three to 5,000 range. And we recommend a one to two ratio from sponsored to organic. So for every one sponsored, you have two organic. But let's look and see how you're performing. Now, as I scroll down, I want you to notice that I sorted the keywords by the most frequently searched. Over here is your sponsored rank and then your organic rank. Now, watch as I scroll down. Do you see where there's no number? These are very relevant words to your product but you're not indexing for them. So right away, I see a ton of exposure that you can get. Look at this one here. This translates, if I believe I looked at this earlier, cents for the house in Spanish. Spanish is one of the, it's actually the second fastest growing language on Amazon, you know, next to English. Um, so this, I would absolutely index for Spanish. You're only competing with 221 other products and there's a ton of search room there. Um, also to your organic rank, when you're in the triple digits like this, it means that your pages, pages, pages deep. So let's put this into perspective if we can. Um, so this is a good one. Here we go. Home luxury scents. You are organically ranked 257 for this. There are over 2,500 people on Amazon US looking for home luxury scents this month. And so that means that they'll have to go through 256 organic listings plus dozens of sponsored listings before they find you. And look how much revenue sellers have earned in the past 30 days through the words home luxury sense. So you've got to ask yourself, is that organic rank of 257 sufficient enough for you to get your fair share of this revenue? And the answer should hands down be no should be no. Now let's talk about competition. So I took the words luxury room spray from your title and I found this listing here. Now I'm not doing any product comparisons. What I want to show you is their advertising plan. Look at this. So they're doing great. They've got 2000 sponsored keywords, over 6,400 organic keywords. Shoot, let's remove the sponsored keywords. They've got 6,400 organic keywords. Even if they just left it at this, they would sell more than you. Um, but they have done a fantastic job of indexing to for these words. They've got a ton more exposure. They have sold over 7,200 units in the past 30 days. So compare that to your sales, looking at the advertising. I would say your keywords need to Im improve. There's plenty of room out there and plenty of revenue. It's just being left on the table. Now, let me show you something that we do here at My Amazon Guy in phase three of our four phased SEO process. So looking at those keywords where you're ranked in spots 20 through 50, right now you've got 59 of them, more than 10% of your keywords. And because of that, you're really not benefiting from that organic traffic. You're having to sponsor the words. And so through our SEO process, we would lift you up in the ranks so that instead of being in spot 30, for vanilla room spray, we'd have you in the top 10. And that goes for all of these organic keywords where you're ranked like this. And if you're not having to sponsor that word anymore, imagine the impact it'll have on your ACOS. So don't forget that it is the words. The words are very important and they're what gets your listing above everybody else's in the search results. So now I'm going to go through your listing, get out of the way there, um, go through your images real quick. I'm curious if you, um, have any lifestyle images? You've got a couple of it. Okay. All right. So what am I, 
this is room spray, but I'm not looking at room spray in these images. I'm confused. <laughs> um, this looks like maybe a soap and a lotion. Um, it could be other products. I'm not sure. But very confusing. I see you've got candles. So this may be, you know, your product suite. I'm not sure. You've got the diffuser there. You really need to focus on this, on your product. Also, to who is your client avatar? Who's your customer avatar? Who is your demographic? You need to see people in these images. I do recommend at least one. And you want to get the sense that they're smelling. It smells wonderful. Have one of them look at the camera. It's a compelling image. And having your demographic is vital in this listing. Also, too, your title and your bullet points are really short. So you can have 200 characters in your title, 250 characters in each bullet point down here. This is why your organics are so low. These are spots where Amazon looks for your organic keywords and you've got really limited information. So I absolutely recommend updating your keywords, your bullet points, your title. Now, let me show you that module. So if you do anything today, please log into Seller Central and right above product description, you'll see a brand story. That's where you can put the Mercy logo. Talk about how you got your start, why you do what you do, what makes you so unique and special. I want to see if this seller has set theirs up. They have not. So bear with me for one moment. I just want to see if I can show you an example. Okay. So we put this listing together for our founder, Stephen Pope, who owns the brand Age of Sage. And as you scroll down, you see all the sponsored ads that show up here. And then just underneath it, you get from the brand. This is the best module that Amazon has come out with for branded sellers in a long time. It zeroes out the noise from your competitors. It's a carousel, so you can add a ton of content tons of hyperlinks to noteworthy products, even your brand store. It's really compelling. I absolutely recommend doing it. Now, also too, the copy that you put in there, the crawlable text, it does index for organic traffic. Now I'm going to look at your alt text real quick behind your images. Yeah. So think of your alt text like this. What are people typing in the, sub, the, the search bar on Amazon? I'm certain they're not typing in Mercy Header 2. They're probably typing in Room Spray, Fragrant Room Spray, Luxury Room Spray, right? So think of those. I would update all of your alt text. Hi, ladies. Um, and then I also recommend a product grid. Clearly, you've got other products. Having a product grid down at the bottom of your A plus content is shown to increase your average order value. So listen here at my Amazon guy, we're a full service Amazon agency and we grow sales on Amazon. We manage over 330 brands, giving our clients peace of mind knowing Amazon is handled so they can focus on their business. But I'd love an opportunity to chat with you. So go ahead and click the link in my email that reads book a call, snag yourself a free consultation. And once you do that, I'll email out the competitive analysis. But hey, thanks so much for watching. I look forward to speaking with you soon. Take care.